Hello, I'm Chris Thompson, Smart Technology Specialist for Oak Hills Needs Center, and today I'd like to give you an overview and tour of the Smart Home on Wheels. The Smart Home on Wheels, or show for short, was made possible by the generous support of the Consumer Technology Association Foundation, AARP of Connecticut, AMRAMP, the Connecticut Tech Act Project, the Greater Hartford Lions Club, and the Gene Griswold Foundation. The idea behind the show is to be a fully equipped mobile demonstration center where individuals and groups can learn more about how technology can support independent living. So here we are in the Need Center in Hartford, Connecticut. When the show isn't on the road, it resides here. Come inside with me and I'll show you some of the technology. And here it is. This is where we showcase how to take control of your home environment, whether you are an individual with a disability or a senior trying to age in place as long as possible, or a caregiver who just wants to have peace of mind that their loved one is safe and can control their home environment by themselves. We are able to control things in the Smart Home Lawn Wheels five different ways. We utilize voice through uh, actually three different methods, whether it be Apple Siri, Amazon Echo, or Google Home Assistant. Uh, head movement, just by moving your head around the tablet, it will follow your nose and you can select specific apps to control things around the home. Uh, this utilizes switch scanning, where it'll actually scan through pages of commands. And once it gets over to the command you would like to select, you hit a button, which is typically placed near the head. And so if you're nonverbal, can move your hands, then you can control things through this app with switch scanning and be able to lock the door, turn on the television, change channels, all through all these preloaded commands here. And in the traditional touch method, we also utilize eye gaze to be able to control things just with eye movement. Uh, examples of things we can control around the Smart Home on Wheels. Uh, the thermostat, the fireplace, the television's completely voice controlled by turning on the television, turning off the television, channel up, channel down, all of these commands we can either speak verbally or through these access methods. We can even control the ceiling fan in here, all the lighting. If white isn't your thing and you feel more soothed with a different color, say blue, you could say, Alexa, make all you lights blue. Okay. There you go. And so I'm going to switch it back because it's a little distracting for me. Alexa, make all you lights bright white. The shades in here are completely um, Wi-Fi friendly. They're smart shades, so we can control them with all these access methods. And another great thing that we can utilize and showcase here is automation. Completely hands-off approach. If someone might not be as willing to embrace smart technology, it's completely hands-off. And another great thing about the smart technology is that it just replaces your traditional technology. You, you look around and it just, it, the, the bulbs replace typical traditional bulbs. The shades replace traditional shades, the ceiling fan, everything looks, even the television, that isn't a smart television. You just uh, hooked up the appropriate hub to be able to control. So that's what we're trying to showcase, this technology that people may not know about or may know about and just don't realize all the capabilities. You can drop into an Echo Show. This is the latest model Echo Show. We have the Echo Dot mounted to the ceiling for a great vantage point. Smart smoke detector. There's so much technology here because this technology is changing rapidly. We want to stay on the forefront and it can be completely hands-off and automated with routine remi reminders through Alexa, a calendar that could be administered by a caregiver, uh, that could be delivered every day so that someone can stay on top of their task more easily. So I'm going to do one more quick demonstration here for uh, someone who, you know, might not want to have to remember to lower the shades, to turn off the lights, to set the thermostat temperature at night, to turn off the fireplace, to turn off the television, to lock the door. It can be consolidated and simplified. For instance, I can give one command and have a variety of tasks taken care of at one time. For instance, Alexa, 
Good night. Currently, in Hartford it's 30 degrees Fahrenheit with mostly cloudy skies. Today, you can expect lots of clouds and snow, with a high of 30 degrees and a low of 2 degrees. Tomorrow, there are two events. At 11 a.m. there's a pertinent with Dr. Martin in West Parker, and at 4 p.m. there's real the class in Manchester. So here at Oak Hill we are a nonprofit, and we are able to showcase uh, the basically the full gamut of smart technology available. So we showcase close to 20 different manufacturers, everyone from Apple to Google, uh, to Amazon, Philips, Samsung, Ecobee. Uh, depending on the needs of the user who would like to start utilizing the smart technology, we can really focus on their ability and what they're looking to accomplish. If you would like to learn more about the Smart Home on Wheels, or if you're interested in a demonstration, please contact us at the email address listed or visit us at assistivetechnology.oakhillct.org. Thanks for watching.